Hypixel Skyblock is an expensive game, with every aspect of it costing tens of billions of coins to max out. And today, we'll be focusing on one of those dungeons, an area that I've neglected for a little too long. With my purse in hand, we'll be spending well over 3 billion coins on a maxed dungeon setup. So, first things first, uh, there was recently an update to dungeons, a little quality of life thing updating the Berserker class, and I actually main Berserker, and I figured this was perfect timing, I was prepping for a dungeon video anyway, uh, so you know, just a little bit extra coinage and I'll be able to play this class even better. Uh, but yeah, no, it's a really nice thing and I might actually be getting into dungeons now. You know, turns out spending 3 billion coins on something makes you kinda wanna do it, uh, who woulda guessed? But uh, where to start, where to start, there's so many things, I literally typed out an entire shopping list on my computer a couple weeks ago just to figure out what I would need. Uh, but you know what? I think we'll start with the armor. But before that, I'm getting pretty close to 24,000 subscribers. And if I can hit that within three days, as well as 2,000 likes on this video, I'm gonna give away... One hundred million coins. So go subscribe. Do it right now. I'm begging you. I'm very desperate. All right, now back to the video. So let me introduce you to my Necron set. If you haven't seen it already, Holly died, nine starred, looking pretty nice and hot. Yeah, it's a it's a crime against humanity. It, it, it's Holly died. So you know we we put this on literal vomit set. It it, it is just vomit. It it it, it vomit vomit armor. Yeah. So, let, let's go ahead and fix this. I've got 3.2 billion coins to work with right now, and you know what? Let's just start on the chest plate. First things first, we're gonna need an art of peace. So, come down here. We have divine gift, a rat jetpack, and, ah, here, here we go. Art of peace. 50 mil, and buy one of these. You know, I don't think I've actually ever maxed anything in the regalia room, so you know what? Slash hex, we'll max the chest plate in here. So, books, art of peace, click to apply. Now we got a nice little red 40 next to the hot potato books and health. I'll also, the enchantments do need a mild amount of work. Alright, front 7, 42 million coins. That is not bad. And we're just going to slap this bad boy on here. And now I'm curious, what is growth 7? I'm assuming this would be uh, painful, to say the least. 158 mil. Maybe at a later date. We're also going to need another Reflection 4 book. So, let me see here. What is the best price on this? Okay, yeah, it looks like just buying 8 Reflection 1s is going to be the best way to do it. 5 mil. And now we can buy all these. And pop that in there, combine it, Reflection 5. Now, I do kind of want to put Counter-Strike 5 on here, but it's just not that useful. We'll come back to that later. You know, I like wasting money, but but not that much. And then I believe last thing, well, second to last thing, that we need to do to this chest plate is we actually need to swap this Pharaoh mana over to Strong mana. Since uh, times have changed a little bit, and from what I understand, you need 3-4 Strong mana and 1-4 Pharaoh mana. The Pharaoh mana typically going on the head, uh, but we'll get to that later. Uh, if you want to know the reasoning, it's basically because mana, the pharaoh caps from it really, really quickly, so four out of four is just a waste of money. Okay, so how much is strong mana? I, okay, 100 mil. It probably would be considerably cheaper to craft it up from strong mana fives. Uh, so yeah, how much would a full inventory of that be? Ooh, that's a lot of money. You know what? 52 mil. Let's see how far this gets us. Okay, so 52 mil got us up to a strong mana 9, and I can see I was right. I saved 12 mil doing that. So let me do a little bit of math. You know what? I'm not good at math. We're just gonna buy, like, I, I don't know, 10 and see... Oh, that might be too much. Okay, we're gonna buy 7. See how far that gets us. 26 mil. See, it looks like we will need an additional 2, and I... Oh, it looks like I have raised prices on strong mana 5. You know what? How much is that gonna be? Uh, yep, nope, I, uh, I have raised prices considerably on strong mana 5, and it appears my math was incorrect. We need an, an additional one. You know what? We're just going to buy a strong mana 7. Is that worth it? Yeah, it'd be about the same price as buying strong mana 5s because I, uh, I I've inflated the prices a little bit. So strong mana 8, another strong mana 9, and we will be getting a strong mana 10. Okay, and now we put it on there, right? Yeah, there we go. 420 levels, strong mana 10. Okay, and now actually the last thing we need to do is this chest plate. Uh, as you can see, it is only 9 star, and we can't have that. Uh, so if we come over here, there's a little thing. And yeah, for 500 XP levels, 86.6 million coins, fifth master star. And I mean, would you look at that? It's just so hot. Other than the fact that it's missing G7, which kind of hurts me, but it's still really hot. And now we just kind of need to do the same thing to the leggings here. Uh, these already have brought seven, so I don't need to worry about that. And considering how much I've inflated strong mana five prices, we're just going to take the lazy way out. 104 mil for a strong mana 10. And yeah, that can just go on there. Oh, yep, there we go. And another 86 mil for a 
another fifth master star. And last but not least, the boots. So snag a little bit of a Prot 7 here, and we can go ahead and chuck that on. I also just realized I forgot one of the most important parts for the leggings. Uh, we, did, we need a we need another Artic piece. Yeah, just get my inventory. Thank you. And yeah, just retroactively uh, put that on. Yeah, there we go, Artic piece. And I was going to say we could buy another Strongman at 10, but I, I bought the only one on the bazaar. <laughs> this is not good. So it'd probably be a little bit cheaper to craft it from Strongman of 4s, but I just can't be bothered. You know what? Strongman of 7s. How many of these are there? Oh, okay. 14 mil isn't going to hurt a little bit. I think I need eight of these. Oh, and there goes a lot more money down the drain. <laughs> Lastly, the strong mana 10. Throw that on there. And this one already has an RDP, so I believe the only thing it is missing will be another star. And another 86 mil for a fifth master star. And yeah, now the set is all beautiful and spicy and maxed out and stuff, but it still looks ugly. Let's fix that. So I've been begged by many people for quite a while to go and re-dye my armor. So let's search up dye. And it looks like we're going to be going with one of my favorite dyes, actually, that being Byzantium. Unfortunately, it has gone up like another 40 mil since I was looking at prices. And uh, uh, where did all the Byzantium go? Yeah, there's only one Byzantium die on the AH. Oh, this is not good. There were like seven when I checked earlier. Oh, why does this always happen to me? So after some deliberation, mild insanity, and crying in that corner over there, I decided that my die of choice will be, uh, drumroll please, Wild Strawberry, or as I've so delicately dubbed it, a Fimboy die. Now, it's definitely not the worst die in the world, but I I just really like Byzantium, but I can't have it. It's so far out of reach. Uh, so, so, yeah, you know, we're just gonna save a little bit of money, go Strawberry die. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so, uh, 66 mil, uh, there we go, that hurt a tiny amount, and 70 mil, also hurting a tiny amount, and then uh, 20 mil more for whatever reason. Yeah, casual 90 mil on a strawberry die, despite it having been 40 mil in the past. There we go, we have three wild strawberry dies. And yeah, just take off the armor, anvil, and we'll just go in here, and uh, yeah, there we go. So we get wild strawberry, oh wild strawberry, and uh, you know, a little bit more wild strawberry. And uh, yeah, my, my armor's Fimboy died now. We love the Fimboy armor. And now, the last thing for the armor set, uh, the head. Now you might have been wondering why I was kind of neglecting it, and why well, I didn't start with it, because I mean, heads are cool, and diamond, and blue, and nice, and shiny, and all the good things, yes. I was because of the new dungeons update, which if I go into my collections, boss collections, I'm going to be mostly running M6, so we're going to be getting a sedan head. Now, funny thing, I'm actually sedan 7 ever since the update came out, and they actually retroactively made your master mode completions count for two. I have 1,115 completions now, and I've unlocked a diamond sedan head, so that's going to save me a solid 140 mil. So let's go ahead and claim that bad boy. Also 25 Skyblock XP, love to see it. And uh, would you look at that? It doesn't look very hot at all. Uh, the pink is clashing, but it's fine. Diamond Sedan Head. And yeah, we're just gonna do the usual run over to the hex, do the funny things, and plop this bad boy in there, and enchantments. And of course, we're gonna be needing the Hecatome. Pop that bad boy on. And Transylvanian, don't know what this does, but one mil Transylvanian five, sure. And this one, we're just gonna be P6ing because I'm gonna get rid of this head later. So no point in completely maxing it out. Growth, uh, put a little bit of a growth six on there. Rejuvenate. Oh, yes, please. And this one we actually need ferocious mana on, and ferocious mana 10 looks a little bit overpriced. And this one actually hasn't had his bizarre prices destroyed, so we're gonna go craft one. So we're just gonna buy 20 for 61 mil, see how far that gets me. Right, and that got us a Ferocious Mana 9 and a Ferocious Mana 7. Uh, so let's buy, like, an additional 8 and see how far that gets us. Another 25 mil. Uh, so it looks like we need an additional 4, so another 13 mil. Right, and there we go, Ferocious Mana 10. And we'll just be popping that on there real fast for 420 XP levels. All right, and now there are a couple more things we need to do. I believe that should be the enchants taken care of, though. Uh, so, I mean, of course, ultimate enchant, that's going to be Legion 5. 27 mil, not too bad. And then books, we just, yeah, all the hot potato books. Yes, please, thank you. All right, and then we actually are going to skip the art of peace because uh, this is a diamond sedan head. I kind of want to actually be able to sell this later when I'm done with M6. Right, and then reforge, of course, ancient. And then, yeah, I just need to five-star this real fast for, like, no coins whatsoever. And now the part that's going to hurt a little bit. The master stars. And first master star. Second master star. A third master star. And a fourth master star. And I actually will be stopping at nine stars with this, because, again, I kind of want to be able to sell this later. Although, when I get a Necron head, uh, you better believe I'm hypermaxing that thing. I will say this head does look a little bit ugly compared to a lot of my other gear. Especially that Hecate 
Dome 1, we can't be having that. I'm gonna need to run a bunch of dungeons. Uh, but other than that, this set is so very hot. And I was thinking about getting a Grand Searing Rune, but the Grand Freezing Rune actually looks pretty good with the Wild Strawberry. So, next on our Dungeons Maxing Armor Video Stuff Journey thing, yeah, we need to max out another term. Now, I already have this one right here, Soul Leader 5, literally only missing two enchants. Other than that, it is completely hypermaxed. Unfortunately, Soul Leader is currently bugged and does not work. And, you know, for boss fights, I kind of need duplex anyway, which is why I have this term. Uh, duplex 3, 5 stars. So far, I've hypermaxed that it might as well just be a piece of garbage. And we're going to be maxing this thing out, making it look like this thing. It's going to be very fun. So, first of all, uh, we need duplex 5 on it. And in my ender chest right here, I happen to have 8 duplex 1 books that I've actually grinded out myself from doing Blaze Slayer. I also dropped Wilson's engineering plans, which I'm still mad about. But in my notes here, right next to duplex 5, it actually says grind from Blaze for epic montage gamer swag. Uh, so, you know, uh, whoopsie daisy. Oh, okay, that didn't take long at all. Also, uh, this boss is second to my PB, 50.25 seconds. My PB is 50.05. Uh, yeah, no, that only took me like 15 minutes. So now that I have all the duplex, uh, let's do some funny things. Max in terms, yes. Just gotta grab all my duplex books, chuck these Wilson's engineering plans off the map, and uh, yeah, I think we're ready to get going here. So we're gonna get a duplex two, another duplex two, a duplex three, and this one we can go ahead and combine with the term right here. And for 157 levels, a duplex 4 on the term. We get another duplex 2, another duplex 2, and we get a duplex 3. And now I'm out of duplex, and I just realized that I'm not good at math. It's okay, I failed Algebra 2. I have an excuse. Oh, well, that's unfortunate. Right as I was gonna go grab that duplex out of the bazaar, uh, it filled. Yay. Funny. Yeah, so let's just claim that, and we're gonna, we're gonna need to buy four duplex ones. Uh, that's, uh, that's a number. Okay, so combine these, we get duplex 4, and for 179 levels, uh, we're gonna be getting a beautiful little duplex five right here. And so now we slowly approach the hex and it, it, it's time to do the thing. We we're gonna, we're, we're doing the thing. We're, we're doing it. Yeah. So Tabasco, easy little rainbow enchant right there. And for nearly 200 mil power seven. I mean, I mean, hey, at least people can't clown on me for not having it anymore. Yay. And then cubism six for 75 mil. Sure. Why not? We love wasting money and it's good for Kutra. And snipe four. Sure. Why not? Who doesn't love spending 100 mil on something that I'll basically never get any use out of? There we go, Rainbow Enchant. Chance 5, why not? It's only 17 mil, that's not even bad, actually. And then the only enchant we're missing is Vicious 5, which is 130 mil. Why? Why am I doing this to myself? I mean, I said I was gonna go and make it look exactly like my other term, and my other term has Vicious 5 on it, so 130 mil, there we go. And yeah, just apply that. And I mean, no one can tell me that this term doesn't look incredible incredibly hot. And just like my other term, the only thing it's missing is Punch, Smoldering, and Divine Gift, all of which are useless. Same thing over here. Uh, so now we have a very, very nice looking term, although the only thing is that we uh, kind of, uh, uh, you know, uh, fix it up a little bit. Modifiers, we, we need some Master Stars. So one Master Star, a second Master Star, a third Master Star, a little bit of a fourth star right here, and a fifth star with a side of depression. Although this term now looks incredibly hot and spicy, and I want to kiss it, like right now. Also, just at a curious curiosity. How much is a music rune 3? 59 mil. You know what? Screw it. This term has no right to look this hot, but it, it's a, it's a, can you, can you not put a music rune 3 on a term? Okay, no, you can definitely put a music rune on a term. Uh, he being death streaks, he has one. So I guess maybe I need to remove the rune on mine first. Rune removal. I guess, uh, goodbye fire spiral 3. And now can I put a music rune on? Oh yeah, there we go. Okay. It's gonna combine that and do the little animation and uh, now the term is even more hot. And you know, just for posterity's sake, uh, just, uh, don't, don't mind me. Yeah, don't, don't, don't mind me. Don't mind me. Don't mind me. Don't, don't mind me one bit. <clears throat> cough, cough. <clears throat> yes. Noises. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Co cough, noises, and eight eye dragon. This was a good use of money. And yeah, now we just we do that. We do that. <clears throat> 
Hmm, that, that the damage. Oh, hey, it died really quickly. I, I just did 13 million damage. Uh, this bow is a little bit ridiculous. No one else on the leaderboard even got a chance to hit it. Also, you know, just for the culture, we're gonna sacrifice this AOTD. Oh, hey, I got Ritual Residue. I, I didn't expect that to work. I mean, that dragon was still like negative six mil, but I got Ritual Residue. Also, just out of curiosity. So, 1.4 billion damage. Just a little bit. Tiny amount of damage, really. And lastly, but not leastly, or, or whatever the expression is, uh, we need some more equipment. Uh, Dom Speed, of course. Also, with one of these pieces actually gonna be a Shadow Assassin Cloak, because, uh, funny thing, this is actually comparable to a Dom Molten Cloak up to Dom 7, and it's like 400 mil cheaper or something stupid, so, I, I mean, of course we're gonna get this. Uh, so 6.9 mil lowest bin, and 8.35 mil for the lowest bin livid fragged one. We're just gonna buy this one. Very, very nice. Pop this bad boy in the hex, and enchants. I don't think we need any of these. How expensive is prosperity? Nope. Uh, cayenne? Cayenne? Cayenne's, Cayenne's actually kind of nice, but th that's not going on there right now. We don't need it. And the reforge we're going to be using is waxed. And then for, you know, a, a couple mil, we can just go ahead and five star this thing. Unfortunately, you aren't able to master star it. It would be really cool if you could, but also last thing, recommed. And uh, yeah, there we go. Nice little mythic cloak. And the rest of it, we just want molten equipment other than the cloak. So I guess we can start with the bracelet and we just search in dom and speed. Scroll all the way to the right and we'll what are the options we're looking at here? So we got 28 mil, nice, nice. 30 mil, nice, nice. 40 mil. And let's see here, are there any with like really good attributes? Okay, okay. 120 mil for Dom 7 Speed 7. That's not bad. Yeah, honestly, this 120 mil one right here, I am down to get that. And there there we go. I, I This is now one of my most expensive equipment pieces. Cool. Also, I don't know how you can have Dom 7 Speed 7 and not even have it recommed, but it's whatever. I won't question whoever was selling that. And I guess next we can do the Molten Necklace. I think this is one of the more expensive pieces. Yep, yep, a little bit more expensive. Okay, so lowest bin is nearly 200 mil, which is not great. So that's Dom 5, and is there like a Dom 6? No, yeah, no. So this Dom 5 speed 4, we're just gonna go with that one right there. And lastly, the uh, Molten Belt, which this looks like is gonna be slightly better at least. And yeah, there's none with like good attributes or anything. So there's Dom speed, speed. Yeah, we'll just go with this one right here, the Dom 5 speed 5. 160 mil. There we go. And these two right here, we're just gonna need to fix up real fast. Apparently you can star these, but I don't think those actually have an effect in dungeons. And also the star is 100 mil, so not gonna do that. We're just gonna throw a recom on there. This one needs some blaze wax, as well as a recom, and there we go. And now we can actually take my old dungeons equipment, and we have a molten cloak with Dom 3 on it, which uh, we don't actually need because I can't combine that with Shadow Assassin Cloak. Also, these over here, they can just get out of here. We don't need those anymore. Although this Dom 3 on this Molten Necklace, I might actually be able to use. Now recently, I have been playing a little bit of Kudra, so I do have a couple of Dom Shards, which we are most definitely going to use, and a couple Speed Shards as well. So I'm not sure if I'll be able to get both of these Dom 6. If I can't, I mean, I'll drop more Dom Shards while playing Kudra. It is not an issue. So this one, Dom 3. Ooh. Okay, hold on. How much is a Dom 3 Shard? So Dom 3 Shards are actually not all that bad. 15 mil. Yeah, I'm just going to buy one. And combine this one in here, we get Dom 4. Then we get a Dom 5, and we combine this with the Dom Speed to get a Dom 6, and then we can actually go ahead and combine two Dominant Shards together, and we can get ourselves a Dom 5, and we can put that on this one to get another Dom 6, and then I have two more Dom Shards left, uh, which means I can make a Dom 5, but unfortunately I won't be able to upgrade either of these, so these Dom Shards I'm just going to hang on to until I inevitably drop some more Kudra. Although these uh, Speed Shards can be put to pretty good use, so we're going to get this up to speed 5, and then we can also get this other one up to speed 6. There we go, Dom speed 6. We can also go ahead and, you know, buy ourselves two speed 3 shards, combine those together, get a speed 4 shard, combine that with my speed 4 shard, get a speed 5, and this is now Dom speed 6. And, uh, yeah, this is a really nice looking equipment set, I must say. And lastly, uh, a few minor things. Uh, we actually need to buy an infinity lead, which that's gonna be 78 million coins. Personally, I don't really think it's all that worth it, but I know people are going to yell at me if I don't have one, uh, so there we go. And then also, this golden pickaxe right here, I need to try and sell this and then buy an F10 diamond, because F10 diamond is marginally better, because, I mean, F10 gold, it isn't exactly throwing, but it isn't the best. So I just sold my F10 gold for 60 mil, and now let's buy an F10 diamond. First of all, we need to go all the way back to basics, and we need to uh, get some sticks. Uh, yeah, there we go, and then we need some diamonds. Yeah, just get, uh, 
three of these. And now we do vanilla crafting inside of Skyblock. This just, this just feels wrong on so many levels. And the fact that I'm going to put like 80 mil of stuff on this diamond pickaxe, you know what? It's fine. Okay, so we need Silexes, which that's just going to be five of those. Yep, there we go. 89 million coins. And yeah, I, I have them now. And they can also go ahead and put efficiency five on that. And we hop into an anvil and we just start putting Silexes on here. Yep, efficiency six, efficiency seven, efficiency eight, efficiency nine, and efficiency 10 on the diamond pickaxe. Uh, now, of course, with something this expensive, I mean, we, we got to recom it. We just can't leave it unrecommed. And there we go. I now have something that is marginally better to a point where it's just not really worth it. Yay. And now the final lastest, last, last of last things to be last. I'm going to buy a Claymore. So I read a community post and originally I wasn't even going to buy a Claymore in this video. I was going to wait for another video and do it then and all that and funny things. But a whole bunch of you goofballs said that I should delay my video to buy a mediocre Claymore. So I'm going to do what you wanted. First of all, search up Dark Claymore. Uh, second of all, spend 400 mil on the lowest spin Claymore. Third of all, hit up the hex and put one for all on it. Is this what you wanted? You wanted this. This is your fault. It's all your fault. You guys wanted this. this is so I actually went back this. and hypermaxed that Claymore. Uh, no, I'm just kidding. I, I borrowed this one. But I did decide to go back and do a little bit of work. Well, I did actually go back and make it a bit less of a crime against humanity. But I didn't have enough money for a recom or a fifth star. Is this what you wanted? It's all your fault. And with my setup all ready to go, I think it's time we do some dungeons. And what better way to do that than streaming? So I decided to stream until my brain exploded. Uh, Y'all can see the stream title. Uh, so I like, y you know, just spent three bill on dungeons. And by just did that, I mean I did it yesterday. And then I went to sleep, but I just spent three bill on it because, you know, you know, you know. Anyways, so I have a claymore. <laughs> yeah, let's just say I completely ran out of money. <laughs> We're just gonna fix my war crime real fast. Item upgrades. We're just gonna go ahead and five star that. And we're also gonna throw a recom on it. While it is still a war crime, it is slightly less of a war crime. Anyway, we're gonna go to the dungeon hub and we're gonna do some funny M6 things. But I mean, just look at this. It's so nice. Like, this is a bad Claymore too, and it's still doing that much damage. Ooh, mini boss. Let's see here, so we can do that. And nope. Also, while I am here, I never actually damage tested my Claymore, and I kind of want to go do that. Yeah, look at that. It's like 50 to 80 mil damage a hit. And this is such a bad Claymore too. It's just, sorry, I'm getting distracted. I should probably be doing secrets, but like, I just, I just love slapping things. I mean, like, decent routes? I don't have routes. <laughs> I'm just kind of doing things. Star is temporarily unavailable. Well, that's interesting. Everything is temporarily unavailable. Well, that uh, would be unfortunate. And in, in fact, not, not even would be. That just is unfortunate. Oh, that, uh, uh, okay. This is interesting. And then slash BZ, yeah, that's down as well. And then auction house is also down. It's back up. Hold on, hold on. Is it back up? Oh, it's back up. Cool. All right, so now we visit Waufo. All right, so rainbow platform in the middle. Th there seems to be multiple rainbow platforms. This is also a rainbow platform. Oh, th this this is also a rainbow platform. Oh, okay, cool. I found the I found the rainbow platform. This is the correct rainbow platform. Uh, let's see here. Yep, that is that is a claymore. Hold on. So let's see here. Uh, trade request. So funny thing, this is uh Walfo's mom controlling the character right now. Right, I'm gonna send one more trade request. If if it don't go through, then we're going back to Dungans. Oh. Oh, it went through. Right now we wait for them to uh, fi figure out how to put a claymore in a trade menu. Am I trying to steal a claymore? Because someone offered me a hypermax one because they uh, are not really playing the game much anymore. So I'm just going to borrow it because funny hypermax claymore. Also, this is taking a while. I, I, I does Wafo's mom not realize that slot locking exists? I'm just... Oh, and right, now he's going to wait for them to figure out uh, the, the accept button. Okay, it, we, we did it. Uh, my mother may have blocked in on me. Okay, anyway, we have a Hypermax Claymore now. We should clear a little bit better. <laughs> Let's just say that. Hi. Why are you speaking into the microphone? I really don't. I, I am streaming. Okay. I, I guess surprise cameo for my sister. You should brush your teeth. No. Your, your breath kind of stinks. No, your breath stinks. No, you won't. No, your breath stinks. No. no. Your breath stinks. Go brush your teeth. No, you go brush your no, teeth. No, your breath stinks. Hey, I brushed stinks. my teeth this morning. Go brush your teeth. Go no, brush your no, teeth. No, thank you. No, no, your, your breath. You brush your teeth. It, it is unnerving me. Why? Like, leaning over my shoulder like that? Mm, no. Do you just want to stream for me? Okay. Yeah, just do my job. So, we're killing the zombies now. Fun, fun. Um, there's been big trade Hmm, fire. You have no idea what's going on. I have no idea what's going on. You have no idea what's going on. We just killed a skeleton. Uh huh. Yeah. Ooh, lava. Mm -hmm, yeah, murder. It, it's murder. Murder. See, they, they all exploded. Oh. You're such you're such an amazing streamer. I'm 
I'm such a great streamer. Thank yeah, you. you should start a YouTube channel. I should. What should I need? Uh, chicken nugget. Chicken nugget, yeah. Chicken. Why does she sound five? She's 12. I'm 12. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you're 12. Yeah, I'm 12. Just get older. Seven. Literal child. You're 17. Literal child. Literal you're, you're, child. You're 17. You're a child. You're, I'm... you're uncomfortably close to my face. Excuse me, I am a tween. Subscribe to enter. Literal child. I do not sound five, whoever better. said that. Skill issue. Just get older. Who? Okay, Shadow Fury. I am 12, not five and a half. A shadow Fury. Fury. What, it looks like furry. That's with two R's. You don't know how to spell. And I don't. Sorry, mom's funny. And that was my, my sister. <laughs> and, and now she's laughing maniacally. And yeah, that's about it. If you watched this far, then I love you. And you know, you may also love this video. It should be on my face right now. I think it's good. Go watch it. Also, subscribe, like, all those things. Uh, goodbye.